Hey, welcome everyone. First video of the new decade. Um, it's been a little while. I've been working on uh, an automation masterclass. So I just wanted to jump in. I saw this question from Scott uh, around how to replicate this little tab that has uh, follower counts. And he wants to automatically update these numbers based on live Twitter followers or Facebook likes. Uh, I won't be able to do the Instagram one based on the tools I'm using, but I did want to show you how you can update the other two. Um, so yeah, so we're going to recreate this in Webflow, or at least we're going to recreate the counts. I'm not a designer, not a very good designer. Um, so we're just going to talk about how do we update this these two numbers automatically. So um, jumping into Webflow, I've got a CMS collection that has two items in it, Twitter and Facebook. And really all I have as a variable here or as a CMS field is the follower or likes. So we've got the service, Twitter, the follower likes, same thing with Facebook. So what we want to do is if we go into this page, uh, we want this these two numbers, the 10 and the zero, to um, update automatically every time we have a new follower or a new Facebook like. So to do that, we're going to use Integromat. So Integromat is um, an automation tool that based on schedules or on actions or triggers happening in applications can go and fetch data for you. In our case, we're gonna do it on a schedule. So I've got the, the little Integromat scenario here in front of me. And essentially just high level what it does, every 15 minutes, it goes to Twitter, gets your follower count, updates, the Webflow CMS item goes to Facebook, gets your uh, like count, and then goes to Webflow and updates the item. So kind of going into more detail, this is going to run every 60 minutes, but I can update that at whatever interval I want. It has to be higher than 15 if you're on the free plan. Uh, I think it goes down to two minutes if you're on the paid plan. Um, so it's not instant. If someone follows you, you that number won't be instantly updated, uh, but it's pretty close. And so what I do is I just kind of integrate uh, my Twitter account. I put my screen name. In this case, it would be your business. And then if we run this, you'll see that you know there's a bunch of informations he information here uh, around my Twitter account. But what we want is this follower account, right? So 739. That's what we want to update right here. So then what we go do is we go to Webflow, give it a second here. Doop, 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 doop. There we go. Uh, I integrate my Webflow, I tell what collection, mine is called followers, and the item itself is Twitter. And then all I do is I plug in that follower account right here, and I re you know set the Twitter name. And if you have a live website, you can push this to live right away. So you won't need to you know, republish your website. So let's run this. So then it's updated uh, my uh, CMS item or field to 739. And then we kind of do the same thing, but with Facebook. So I have kind of a company page here. And if I run this module, it's gonna run the whole flow up to there. And then I want this country page likes, right? So 911. And if I go into my Webflow item, I do the exact same thing. Uh, instead of the Twitter follower account, I put the Facebook likes right here, put the name as Facebook, set live to yes. And then let's run. There we go. And then it's updated. Oh, I got to run the whole, we can run the whole thing. There we go. And then we have follower likes 911. So what we've done, went to Twitter, got the follower account, updated the item, went to Facebook, got the number of likes, updated the item. And then if I refresh here, do 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 and go to my page. I have Twitter, 739, Facebook, 911, which is what we wanted. Um, so yeah, very simple. Uh, you can probably do this on the free tier for a while. Um, yeah, 
So first video of the new decade. If you enjoyed these kinds of automations, I'm working on a automation uh, no code class to show you Integromat, Zapier and Parabola. Uh, sign up to my weekly newsletter uh, to get the best deals and uh, updates on that class. So hopefully this helped you, Scott and others. Um, yeah, I'll see you around. Cheers. Bye.